So after playing for, I started for, uh, with Golden Boys, a Division II, a Coast Club. Uh, fast forward, they went to a final uh, that is now newly named as Wafa Football Club. He just uh, spent this, just a little stint with them and then he came to Cheetah Football Club. Uh, fast forward, he was with uh, Porto, that was his first international uh, play, uh, international uh, football game uh, with FC Porto. And FC Porto had to learn him to uh, Ryan Ave. From there, he's played Chelsea, Vitesse, Newcastle, United, Everton, Bournemouth, and then finally he had to finish with Hayatea Sport. Christian Atu, uh, many know what he's done, uh, even off uh, the football pitch. But today he's no more following uh, the rebel that happened in Tekia, uh, where he was uh, found dead. And today, the Cheetah Football Club and also top talent are on him even before kickoff. Still 0 0 here, the Senya. And the Predators then appear. And Apia plays into the channel. But it's mopped away by Gideon, who is a skipper for the days. He's captain the team. Uh, two consecutive games last week, he captained the team as well. Uh, and he spared the team to win their game by three goals last weekend. And he is holding the armband again today. Slimba. For Cheetah FC, they are mourning their former player, Christian Achu, who passed on under the rebel yesterday. Abel, he's looking for Ishmo. And Ishmo, his control was a bit lazy and it rolled out for a goal kick. Top talent after the season with uh, not. Not a good one, really. Uh, they lost their home game. Uh, and fast forward, they are unbeaten in two consecutive games. They've won all two games at home and away. And they've come here with some confidence. Kobna Tete was brought down. Lovely still by Aku. Here is Hayford coming forward for Cheetah Football Club. He's found Apia. He's onside here, Apia. Apia is onside. Apia won't try to go past his marker. But that is a wonderful defending by. They have a present. Midfield there by Apia. He has seen that opportunity disappear. Number 18. Number 18. On number 18 will be withdrawn. That is Hackman Francis. He will be withdrawn. He's played his part. And obviously, he you a goal. And referee said Tio Mingo was uh, impeded, and so uh, he's won that free kick. Bonnie leaves it for. Kobna has Kobna thought he has picked the pocket of the defender, but his effort was way off target there. Hey, 
So Richard will have a pep talk with his coach, Emmanuel Clote, before entering into the fray to have his uh, bite also in this one. It's still 0-0 between Cheetah Football Club and top talent, Bonny. Sets it to the channel! What a chance! What a glorious opportunity for Akakto. And so Richard Mensah will enter the fray. Last week he scored a sumptuous header on this ground and it was some uh, beautiful moment for himself and the coach Emmanuel Clotter who hugged him after scoring that wonderful header and he's throw him into uh, the game again to see if he can replicate what he did last week. Mentor. Mohamed. Abel trying to look for the run of Mensa he's found him in that channel. And he complained and he was actually telling the referee. And he's gone into the book of the referee for simulation. And the man who last weekend were in for all the right reasons this time around. And just two minutes, he's in for the wrong reasons. There's still time in it. Let's see what he can do again to restore that favor for his coach. Latif Blessing. He sends it all the way back to his goalkeeper, Joshua Blay. John Blay. Hayford. Now to Blay. And Blay finds Hayford again. Yakubu. On side, Kobina. And Bonnie has there to check him. And he has done that job brilliantly. Akwesi has won a free kick. Deep inside his own half. It sends a long and miscommunication between Slimba and Blay, but eventually Slimba allowed it for Blay to catch it. He has able. And miscontrol. And Corbin has also given the ball away. He asks Mohammed for. Top talent. He's also giving the ball away. Abel. He's got an hay forward into the channel, but comfortable claim by Samuel Tuga. Come! Come now! Come keep on it! Come now! Caught off on now being played here. Yeah, the Predators then between Cheetah Football Club and Top Talent is still 0 0. Menta. Lovely skill from the young chap there. He's been brought down just around the center circle. It's a free kick. Cheetah Football Club, they do their very first game. 
the went away from home to lose a game, the one here last weekend. He fought. One passes marker, it's from Yakubu. Lovely play from Yakubu. Spread away to Charles Apia. He can conjure something. Abel. He's been engaged. Gideon. Arthur. And Arthur with his weaker foot. Charles Apia. On two. Gideon, the skipper. He's found Abel. Hayford trying to play in the channel. What a save. It wasn't comfortably kept by Samuel Tuga. But what a pass there from Hayford into the part of Yakubu. That boss could have gone anywhere. And you just sense that Cheetah Football Club could nick it. Throw in is to come. Yakubu, Abel, Hayford. Charles Apia, he likes to draw men to him. And it's to Hayford. And penalty is given. And the referee points to the spot. And it's a penalty. And penalty has been given. The ball ricocheted the hand of the defender. And the referee had no choice than to point to the spot. And the yellow card has also been shown. And Kovina is to take it. He scored a goal last week here. Other predators then. He is face to face with Samuel Tuga. Kovina. And Kovina, he makes no mistake. Samuel Tuga went the right way. But Kovina knew what he was about doing. He picks his spot and he dispatched it beautifully. And Cheetah Football Club are ahead. And at the time that they mourn their former player, they are on the verge of clinching it. The champions. Top talent, what have they got now? What have they got? Bunny. And to nobody in particular. <laughs> One that tussle. Yakubu. He fought screaming for it. He's, he's got it. Mental is giving the ball away. And he's impeded. I could see Slimba dealt with it. Back to Akwesi. He didn't control properly. And here is Cheetah coming forward. And Akwesi is back again. <laughs> Offsides given. The ball just couldn't keep it intact and it's a throw in to the Champions Cheetah Football Club who are already in front via a penalty kicked by Kobina who last week also 
scored here at the same end. Top talent are preparing to make a double substitution. Number 19 and number 12. Quickly taken by Latif Blessing. Blay delayed a bit, but Yakubu has won it. Bunny been displayed. Cheetah can counter. He has Charles up and Charles up here shot outside. Mingo, Mohammed, Akusi, Mohammed, and coming out, lovely tattoo, Mensa, and he's still going. And now, had to steal it from his boot. But here's Cheetah once more. Arthur came down the middle to win that tussle. Yakubu. Face to face with Bunny. Here is Abel. Spread away to Arthur. And Arthur has kept it brilliantly. What a control. Hayford. Gideon. And Cheetah has played some wonderful football. For it, and that ball was a fraction too heavy. And Stephen Abel will guard it, and it's out of play. Double substitution. It looks like a boat and Kobinatete will be withdrawn. For that, we are very sure of it. Akwesi. To the path of Nanayao. Uh, some heckling and tussling. But Blay has it comfortably, and his distribution has been perfect. Yakubu. Hayford controls it beautifully. What a pass from Hayford to Kobna. But Akwesi is the. Wonderful defender by Akwesi. But what a touch of a beauty from Hayford. Hey, to the arm of Hayford, and so it's a free kick. And the ball will be withdrawn. Yeah. Double substitution above and Kobina Tete also be withdrawn. And 
it was a late challenge from Slimba on Theophilus Mingo. And the referee actually spotted something and he's given a free kick. Number 10. And Teofilas Mingo needs a medical attention at the moment. Mohammed to take it! Comfortable save. And the players run to the referee. The ball did cross the line, but the referee had none of that. And Bunny, that's in the book of the referee, after a persistent person. Native blessing, Abel. Mohammed's lost possession. Now four on two. Kamina. Charles Apia. Charles Apia. And Abel. And Charles Apia, Abel all squandered that opportunity. He went past his back as if he wasn't there. But in the end, the end put out disappeared. A man's size effort is wide and horrible. And the referee has moved down straight to the lineman and signaling something. I'm sure he he has seen something. Blay. And Cheetah preparing another substitution. It will be a double substitution. Gideon. And Mensa let it roll into the pound of Kabina, but somehow two got claim it clean. Yakubu. Gideon, hey, Ford. Good distribution by Cheetah Football Club. Even under pressure. They are playing the ball comfortably. Gideon, what a lovely play by Cheetah Football Club. Scintillating football, fabulous football from them. Coming out into the channel, and coming out one pass is mark up, but Bonnie is there to mop up the danger. Abel, claim it beautifully. Napia was late. Oh, 
into the channel. And here they are, coming forward again. And Slimba tried to avoid the corner. And so Ibrahim will also be entering into the fray for Cheetah Football Club, done in number 22 shirt. And Abel, Abel will be withdrawn. Number 17 out, 18 and 17. And Arthur will also be withdrawn as well. Idris is also take up the place of Arthur, who's also done a wonderful job this afternoon. And it's a like for like substitution. Idris will take out his place at the right back position. Gideon. And Kovna was, was a bit slow. Here is Aford. Champions are on the verge of winning back-to-back -back games. Here are the Predators then. Struggled in the game. They lost. But an opportunity here for top talent. Oh, that could have gone anywhere. Akakpo had that opportunity. Which Gideon had to present it to him. But it ricochets and it's out for a corner. He fought heads clear. And Cheetah can come forward. They can counter. Four on three. And that is a timely defending by Bonnie. Akwesi. Top talents. They need a goal and they need it quickly here. Ibrahim. To Yakubu. And Kobna has, has gone early and he was just outside. Bunny. Tried to uh, set Mingo on his bike, but Mingo didn't get it early. Remember, Hayford. Wonderful pass to Yakubu. Yakubu shredding it to Kobna. And Kobna lays it back. And Menta, who was late. Two floors. Mohammed. Back to two floors. Down the center circle, he found Bonnie. On the left hand side. And Yakubu is having a good day at the other office. And he's kept it in play. Face to face with Slimba. Abu is down on the turf and the referee says it's a free kick.
a tough loss, free kick was beyond everybody and it's out for a goal kick. And Sam. And Yakubu screaming for it. And he's not spotted Yakubu's run. <laughs> Mohammed. And there goes the final whistle on the day that Cheetah Football Club were mourning their former player, Christian Atu, who. A pass on yesterday uh, under the rubble of the earthquake that happened in Texas. And today they made it happen. Uh, to sure that they actually waved a goodbye. Rest in peace to their former player. And it is finished here at the Predators Den. Can't get see of a penalty kick from Kobina who dispatched it beautifully. The referee. Not a referee, but Kobna saw where the goalkeeper was. So even the goalkeeper went the right way, but he just couldn't keep that one out. It's the Predators then, Cheetah Football Club, one, top time.